Possessing sharp claws and superior hunting skills, lions are the fear of many animals. But when faced with large species like the African buffalo, lions can also be defeated. The lion noticed a large wild buffalo, and soon two lions attacked the buffalo so hard that the buffalo fell. Very quickly, the buffalo ran up to the lion and gave it a very strong butt. The hit was so strong and so fast that it made the lion fly into the air. The leopard is slowly approaching to attack the wildebeest. The big cat steps very close to the wildebeest and prepares to attack. Next, the leopard rushes over and grabs the prey. The remaining wildebeest, after a moment of calm, uses its power to return the siege to its fellows. A lioness lying motionless is attacked by the wild buffalo. Not having time to run away, it's pushed down by the wild buffalo and attacked with a very strong butt. The lion was seriously injured after the fight. Buffalo is surrounded by a herd of lions. They are very aggressive and do not leave the way for buffaloes to run. The lions are surrounded to hunt the wild buffalo. They're very careful to hunt this prey together. Although they tried their very best to counterattack with the solidarity of the wild lions, they could not escape the siege. Buffalo uses his horns to gouge the stomachs of the lions in front. A herd of wild buffaloes pulls until it sees its fellow being attacked by a lion. The lion tried to grab the prey until another buffalo approached to attack. Then the lion gave up and ran away. A male lion from afar rushes to the buffalo herd and grabs the young wild buffalo. How long does it take for the lion to catch the calves before the angry mother rushes over? The mother buffalo uses her two sharp horns to go mad at the lion, causing it to flip over. Fortunately, the mother buffalo only taught the lion a warning lesson. Facing a large herd of buffalo, the lion stubbornly grabs the baby buffalo. An adult buffalo risks his life to chase the lion. A wild buffalo lost its herd and was attacked by four lions. The fierce lions rushed in to attack incredibly fiercely. The lions all tried to tear into the buffalo's carcass. The wild buffalo is dead. And will it fail under these lions? Fortunately, the buffalo's comrades came to the rescue. The terrible butts made the lions run away, and the buffalo was safe. A spectacular chase between the Grass King lion and the big black enemy, the buffalo. There was a time when it was caught by the lions and attacked. Under the deep bites of the body, the wild buffalo is not afraid to respond. The fight went from the grassland to the main road. Even the horns of the wild buffalo collided and shook the entire car. Using the chaotic opportunity, the wild buffalo had a chance to run away. The lions entered the territory of the buffalo herd and the end. With a plan to take down such large prey, the lions try to close in and hunt the prey that is separated from the herd. However, any lion that comes close to the buffalo herd will be attacked by the wild buffalo with very strong butts. The situation is not favorable. 
the lions have no way to hunt for prey. The lions are watching the hippopotamus from afar. A huge hippo ran towards the lion, causing the lion to run away. In an open land, hippo is sunbathing. Lion recklessly attacks the hippo. But hippo discovered it turned back to attack the lion. The hippo uses its power to lift the lion up. The lion was completely exhausted from the weight of the large muscular hippo. Hippos were bathing in cool water when three lions appeared in the distance. Seeing the hippo running in their direction, the three panicked and swam quickly. Hippo attacks a lion, startling it, trying to run away because of the pain. The ferocious hippo attacks the lion and chases it ashore. The other two lions also panicked and tried to run to the shore. The hippo was playing with its baby in the water when the lion on the shore approached. The lion is quite brave when in front are all huge hippos. Both large animals chase each other on the water, but with their large body, the hippopotamus has the upper hand to chase the lion from its territory. The huge hippopotamus is confronting a herd of lions head on. They circle around the hippo to spy out the opponent. But this time, it's not a one-on-one -on -one confrontation, but a herd of lions and hippos. Giant hippos and lions both need water, so there are frequent clashes between them. The giraffe is trying to run away from the lion's claws. Lion tries to jump on people to cling to giraffes. But because of his aggressiveness, the lion received a bitter ending. He was constantly hit by the giraffe with many kicks. In the middle of a large field, a herd of zebras fled in panic when a lion ran up. The lion quickly grabbed the prey by the neck, pressing it on its back to the ground. Immediately, the mother zebra appeared and attacked the lion. Mother Zebra throws a kick in the lion's face, causing it to fall painfully. In the end, the zebra rescues its baby before the hunter. With the appearance of the mongoose, the lion jumped back, regaining some composure and stood looking at the mongoose. Another lion saw this and ran to attack the mongoose, but this lion stopped him. It seems that this mongoose is not the lion's favorite food. They just sit and watch, not intending to attack. The quarrelsome mongoose continuously rushes towards the lion that's eager to eat it, despite the opponent being many times larger. When the lion appeared to be panicking and constantly backed away, the mongoose bared its sharp teeth to close on the enemy. Although the lions were dominant in number, they still did not dare rush forward and pounce on the small civet. The mongoose makes a hissing sound as soon as it emerges from the burrow, showing its readiness to fight. When he saw the opponent constantly approaching him, the lion responded with a blow to the head, but that was enough for the mongoose to give up. A mongoose was caught by a lion in its sharp teeth. Seeing the mongoose not moving, the lion released the mongoose from its mouth. Upon release, the mongoose tried to escape, but the lion quickly held back its prey. When he saw that the prey was seriously injured in the lion's leg, he did not care much more because he knew that he would release the mongoose, it would not run away. The lion no longer holds the prey, but releases it and watches the difficult steps. The mongoose deceived the lion and took the opportunity to run away, but was discovered by the lion and caught. Seeing that the nest was near, the mongoose tried to attack the lion and quickly hid in the safe nest. 
The baboon, who was hiding in the bushes, saw the lion passing, and the monkey rushed out to chase the lion. With the sudden appearance of the baboon, the lion was also startled for a few parts and ran away. Without preparation, the baboon takes one step forward, the lion takes a timid step back. Seeing his comrade come to the lion, he turned the situation around in a spectacular way. This image is what lions find most unclean and humiliating. It was suddenly attacked by a baboon, and it had to run away for its life. Spotting a guanaco, the lion runs up and jumps on the guanaco. It was thought that the guanaco had been caught by the lion, but immediately the guanaco turned around. The rotation of the guanaco, causing the lion to lose his arm, leads to a fall. Angry Lion tries to chase the guanaco. The prey tries to escape with its speed and agility. The cold-blooded lion saw a pair of mother and cubs walking. Immediately, this lion had a plan in mind to steal the baby elephant from the mother elephant. The lions run to catch the baby elephant. The alert mother elephant promptly discovered the lion running. The mother elephant began to attack to protect her cubs. The big trunk of the mother elephant has chased away the hunters. The guanaco camel is engrossed in the grass and unaware of the approaching danger. The lion hid behind the big grass and watched and began to attack. took off very far and jumped on the guanaco and immediately pinned it down. But life is not like a dream. Guanaco camel counterattacks and immediately kicks back at the lion. The footage was shot in the grasslands of South Africa, which can be said to be ruled by lions. A large rhinoceros and the group of lions began to engage in head-to-head -head combat. After a while, the rhinoceros left. The lion's trying his best to keep his prey on the ground. The buffalo regains its strength, stands firm and tries to escape the lion's teeth. In the end, the buffalo rammed the lion causing it to fail miserably. Herd of deer accidentally caught the eye of a hunter hiding in the distance. The lion suddenly rushed over, causing the deer to panic and run in all directions. Lucky for the deer, because the lion was so subjective, it slipped on the puddle. In the end, the lion missed the meal. Elsewhere in the arid land, the mother and daughter of the wild buffalo fell into the lion's sights. Seizing the opportunity, the lion rushed to the mother and the buffalo. The mother buffalo instincts protect her child in a safe place. Then the mother buffalo decides to fight the lion. However, one of the lions managed to catch the calf. The mother buffalo came to the rescue, but it was too late. The mother buffalo left in pain, and the young buffalo became a meal for the two lions. The lions were enjoying their meal when a wild buffalo ran and attacked at the lions. It rammed the lion on the outside, even on one side of the sharp buffalo horns, which had pinned the lion's hind legs. The lion was finally out of danger, but his legs were badly injured. Aggressive lions chasing a herd of wild buffaloes of more than a dozen. A lion was stuck in the tree and was heard by the buffalo. Not giving up the chance to take revenge, the wild buffalo intends to bite the lion's foot of the tree. 
the opportunity for revenge failed, and it was clawed by the lion. Feeling safe, the lion jumps down and runs away. Two lions begin to harass the buffalo herd. They are quite aggressive when facing a large herd of wild buffalo. Small in number, the two lions are hard to compete with the wild buffaloes. However, the two lions still follow this herd of buffalo. The lion attacked the buffalo herd, causing them to run away. Thanks to the quick actions, the lion has collected delicious food for him. Did this lion successfully hunt? A big wild buffalo ran up and rammed the other small buffalo to rescue it from the lion. The lion ran away for a while and then returned because the buffalo was dead. It still has a big harvest for today. Heart in mouth moments for the giraffe walking towards her injured child. A hyena has discovered its injured prey. It has approached it. Seeing the hyena's appearance, the frightened baby deer tried to get up and walk away from the hyena. But because of the injuries, it was walking no longer stable. When she saw the hyena approaching, the giraffe mother actively rushed to chase the hyena away from her baby. After being chased away, the hyena still came back and continued to perform its purpose, but was still discovered by the mother giraffe that it had chased the hyena more intensely. Although he tried his best to protect the baby, in the end, the giraffe's baby was brutally killed by the hyenas. A lion crept close to the giraffe from behind. Slowly, many lions have surrounded them. With the advantage of greater numbers, the lion attacked the giraffe first, and it rushed to bite the giraffe's neck with a painful bite, and it threw the lion away from her body. With the giraffe's splashes and shots, the lion was quickly knocked off the giraffe's body. Not stopping, the lion still jumped up to attack the giraffe, but still ate the opponent's shot. The giraffe was surrounded by a group of lions. Fiercely attacked, a jumping lion even jumped up and bit the butt of the prey. In the end, the giraffe still has to fall by the lord of the jungle. A mother giraffe protects her wounded baby from predators. The hunters, who had targeted their prey that was seriously injured, slowly approach the prey. But with the protection of the mother giraffe, the predators have not dared to act yet. More and more predators come, and they take turns fighting for their prey, but they're still chased away by the mother giraffe. With the ferocity of the other mother giraffe, the hunter does not want to attack too fiercely. A territorial struggle is about to break out between two giraffes. The first hits, and then the brutal battle begins. The giraffe is determined to have zero tolerance for anyone who takes its territory. Its opponent is a very self-involved victory and decides to attack. With weapons of the fatal blows up to the opponent, the competition surprised many viewers. In this fight, two giraffes constantly attack each other with their god-given weapons. They possess kicks no different from zebras. The long neck was also used in this battle. Of course, the giraffe's war caused an uproar in the whole region. It seems that they put all of their energy into this fight because no one wants to lose to their enemy. After half an hour, the two decided to end everything. A rare scene in the dramatic battle between two giraffes. They're fighting to strengthen their position. A giraffe in battle lost focus and was pulled by the opponent's leg and it pulled its neck. It was struggling to pull its leg down. 
taking the opportunity this giraffe tried to keep the opponent's foot on its neck to give it the advantage to attack its enemy. After struggling for a while with the stuck leg, the giraffe was able to pull the leg down and remaining the spirit to start fighting. Not being able to attack the opponent, the giraffe continues to keep the neck. But very quickly, it pulled its neck down. Can you guess who will win? Famous for their superior hunting skills and always outnumbering their prey, lions rarely allow their enemies to escape. However, it seems that the giraffes always make it difficult for lions to confront. Once close to their prey, the lion waits for an opportunity to attack. When the baby giraffe falls, the lion takes the opportunity to rush down to the young prey. The mother giraffe didn't have time to get down when the lion jumped down to bite the baby giraffe. The lion's painful bites made the giraffe unable to resist. When the lion had finished its prey, the lion moves the prey to a safe place. When the lion was trying her best to pull her prey back, the mother giraffe rushed out to save her baby, but it was too late. Seeing the mother giraffe leave, the lion returned to continue pulling the prey back to its territory. Approaching the prey, the mother giraffe suddenly rushed out, causing the lion to run away. Although the baby giraffe was motionless, the mother giraffe still stood to protect the body. A giraffe is standing eating its neck on the savannah. A lion has aimed at the giraffe and the lion slowly approaches. The giraffe still doesn't know the danger is coming. It's still engrossed in eating grass. When the opportunity came, the lion rushed to the giraffe and began to chase it. Very quickly, the giraffe discovered the lion and quickly ran away. After trying to run away for a while, the giraffe still couldn't cut into the tail of the lion. When it was close to the giraffe, the lion jumped up and grabbed its butt. Very quickly, the lions came together to bite their prey, not allowing it to escape, and with the cooperation of other lions, the giraffe fell to the floor. The clip shows the other two rushing towards each other, grabbing each other's necks violently. The fierce blows of the two are not inferior to each other. These two giraffes are very evenly matched. Two giraffes fight mainly by banging their heads and necks. Longer necks tend to produce more speed and power. With a continuous hit of a giraffe has fallen. Seeing the opponent fall, this giraffe doesn't want to attack anymore. It's a little known fact that the long entangled neck of this animal is a powerful weapon to help them in intense clashes. Although not aggressive, giraffes are ready to counterattack when necessary, not only against predators but also individuals of the same species. Their fighting movements look like flexible rhythmic bends, but also full of damage. It can be said that the neck spanking is the most annoying form of violence against this animal. While dodging the opponent's dangerous attacks, one of them suddenly lost his momentum and fell to the ground and the fight between them also ended. An engrossing eating leaves and the lions rushed from behind to chase the prey. Giraffes are a favorable prey for lions in the wild, but not every hunt of this notorious predator turns out to be as successful as expected. One by one, lions took turns jumping and clinging to the giraffe's tail and legs. When the lion did not have time to bite his teeth to control the enemy, he immediately received the giraffe's heavenly kick. After a while of chasing, the giraffe also had to die for the lions. The elephants were drinking water as usual when danger lurked for them. A crocodile suddenly jumps up and grabs the trunk of the largest elephant. The elephant struggles to escape from those sharp iron teeth. Not only did he get out, but before he left, he gave the crocodile a butt. The lake has many dangers that are difficult to predict. A pair of terrifying eyes that follow the elephant's every movement. Crocodiles have begun to gradually approach the elephants. The elephants were drinking when the crocodile came up and grabbed the trunk of the baby elephant, causing it great pain. 
The baby elephant is frantically wagging along and the mother elephant beside her tries to help the baby elephant escape the grasp of the crocodile. The crocodile dives away. The elephants safely cross the river. Elephants and rhinos are the two largest herbivores in the wild. Sometimes they will conflict because of territory. Elephants will have the upper hand in body, so it takes the initiative first in this battle. But the rhinoceros also has a very sharp horn in the front to respond to the huge enemy. The battle is coming to a climax. The two sides have declared war, gradually coming up with more and more moves. No matter how hard you try, the rhino can't beat the elephant. It was chased out of the territory by the elephant. And the rhinos run away together. Two elephants had a territorial dispute with a hippo. The hippopotamus is so fierce it roars to warn the two big opponents in front of them. And faced with the aggression, the elephants must back down. An unlucky rhinoceros entered the territory of the forest elephant. Meanwhile, wild elephants are enjoying their food. The ignorant rhino ran to tease the elephants, but the angry elephants threw a wooden stick. The warning message has worked. The rhinos do not dare do anything more. The chickens were standing where the eagle flew down, causing the chickens to run away. The mother hen saw the danger. The mother hen very fiercely attacked the eagle, leaving the eagle no chance to respond. Not stopping, the mother hen continued to attack fiercely, making the eagle stunned and could no longer stand. A baby deer is very weak, and I don't know what it's just gone through. With the comfort and encouragement of the mother giraffe, the baby giraffe tried to get up, but it seemed too weak to stand. With the baby's constant efforts, it was able to stand and keep its balance. Step by step towards her mother and ask for a protection. The hedgehog curled into the middle of the road. It took the help of the hooded crow who run to the side of the road and stopped and curled up. The hooded crow continued to peck at the hedgehog to urge to push it out of the way. The brown snake eagle is a large bird of prey and true to its name, its forte is to hunt snakes. After detecting the snake's location, the brown snake eagle quickly flew to approach its prey in the hope of getting a good meal. Contrary to the usual fear of the prey facing the hunter, the snake keeps an extremely calm attitude and calmly defends itself. By this time, the brown snake eagle has run out of patience and starts attacking its prey. It scratched the snake's body with its claws. However, the brown snake eagle that hunts brown snakes is not immune to snake venom. A hawk stands on the tree branch observing his prey. When he sees an opportunity, the eagle swoops down. Stepping on the crow's body and starting to attack, the two sides seem to be evenly matched. Although he tried to attack the predator very fiercely, the crow was still no match for the hawk. After a while of confrontation, the crow became the hawk's delicious prey. In the snow-covered landscape, the bald eagle is enjoying its delicious prey. In the wild world, the competition for prey always takes place. This bald eagle is no exception. Also indispensable for the presence of wolves, the wolf saw that the prey was already laid out. With the greed of the wolf, it was very strong to strike and rushed to bite the eagle. Seeing the ferocity of the wolf, the bald eagle also helplessly left. 
The dog was standing and looking at the peaceful surroundings when the crow approached from the behind the dog. The dog was afraid as usual and turned to look. The crow saw the dog turn and stood dumbfounded and approached the dog. The dog saw it and jumped up to scare the crows, causing them to panic and fly away. They did not stop and continued to approach the dog, but as soon as the dog jumped up, they were afraid to fly away. Repeatedly like that, I don't understand the purpose of the crows approaching the dog. Not yet attacking the two opponents, was startled away. The war is now officially started. After the rabbit's attack, it's time for the crow to attack again. When the crow attacked back, the rabbit was afraid to run into the dust. The crow approached the bush to look for the rabbit when suddenly the rabbit rushed out to attack the crow and then fled. Not giving up, the crow was still waiting for the rabbit to come out to retaliate. At this time, the rabbit just rushed out to attack. Hooded Crow is playing with a mouse. The mouse is not a gentle person and it gives up its attack. Continuously galloping up to attack the predator twice its size, the Hooded Crow can only dodge the attacks. After dodging for a while, the Hooded Crow waited for the right moment to attack again. When the rat lost focus, the hooded crow quickly grabbed the rat's tail and pulled it back. Seeing the mouse's weakness in the chasing part, hooded crow took advantage of this and attacked the mouse's tail, continuously dragging the mouse to become more and more panicked, no more decisive attacks on the target anymore. Some also tried to approach from behind, but had to give up because they were hit by the giraffe's kick. The gentle kick was enough for the lion to fly out of his body. Seeing that the situation was not good, the other lions did not stop rushing in. The long neck is both a tool for food and a weapon of self-defense. Although they have large bulky bodies and long necks, they can run at quite high speeds when chased by predators. The crow struggled to get away from the cat's teeth, but the cat wasn't so easy for the crow to escape. The fight may have been because the crow was the one who started it first, but the one who took the initiative was now the weaker one. With the fierce struggle of the crow, the cat still did not loosen its vigilance. It still held on to the crow. When the crow was no longer moving, the cat dragged the crow into the bushes. Even though he was tired from his best escape, the eagle's pursuit, the lizard still couldn't escape. The hare rushed to the crow, causing the crow to panic. Not stopping there, when seeing the crow swooping down to the ground, the rabbit continued to pounce on the crow with delight. Seeing the crow fly up and down again, the rabbit followed each beat to beach the crow. The helpless crow cried out for help from the nearby animal. But the nearby crow did not know how to get up and it flew away despite the crow calling for help. While walking slowly, the rabbit changed its target and rushed at the crow, causing it to suddenly fly up and hide. A hawk is using its strong legs to hold the crow to the ground and continuously peck to finish off its prey. The surrounding crows rushed to peck at the hawk, but those pecks had no effect on this predator. Even though he had to fight back, the crow was still unable to reverse the situation. Seeing the crow's effort, the surrounding crows also intended to rush to the rescue. Before they could act, the eagle threatened and flew away. In the clash between the hawk and the crow, the musket cutter used its legs to hold the crow's neck and disable its opponent. Unable to reverse the situation, the crow used its beak to cut off the hawk's legs so they would not be able to attack anymore. The hawk struggled to pull his legs out of the crow's beak, but couldn't. Try to use your wings to repeatedly hit the enemy's face to stun the hawk. But all of the attacks of the crow did not hurt the hawk at all. They just held each other tightly to prevent each other from escaping. 
the snake is crawling on the green grass field. The red-tailed falcon saw the appearance of the snake and it approached. Not intending to attack, the red-tailed falcon just approached and stood by the snake's tail. When he spotted the red-tailed falcon behind him, the snake turned around to try and bite the falcon, but fortunately the falcon evaded it. After chasing the red-tailed falcon away, it slowly crawled back to its safe place. The battle for territory between two giraffes will initially be just light bumps. After the gentle collision, they begin to attack with more powerful attacks. Not yielding to each other, they still try to use their strongest head and long neck to hit their opponent. These two opponents are still working hard to attack, but the opponents do not seem to cause too much damage to each other. After a while, it took a lot of strength to hit the opponent, but they got tired and they gradually ended the match here. The baby rhinoceros followed behind the giraffe. It went behind and ate the giraffes. When it saw the rhinoceros walking behind her, the giraffe raised its hind legs to scare away the baby rhino, but it seemed that the baby rhino was not afraid. Only when the baby rhino gets the head of the giraffe's kick, it runs away scared. When she saw the lion approaching the cub's position, the mother giraffe launched a kick, but unfortunately hit her baby. Taking the opportunity, two lions rushed to attack the mother giraffe. One lion jumped to bite the giraffe's butt, and with that surprise, the giraffe struggled to throw the lion away. The mother giraffe is still standing to protect her baby, when suddenly attacked from behind by a cold-blooded lion. The mother duck and her ducklings are running around, not knowing what they're looking for when they came across a crow. The crow says this and also tries to approach the ducklings, but was quickly discovered by the mother duck and rushed to chase the crow away. Although the mother duck rushed to chase away the crow, it seemed that the crow was fearless and it continued to creep closer. Constantly being chased away by the mother duck, the crow still stubbornly refused to leave and continued to approach. The crow has no intention of giving up, and it keeps coming back. The eagle owl stood on the rock. Behind the black crow stood watching the eagle owl and taking the opportunity to peck at the owl and fly away. Although more and more crows approached, the eagle owl did not mind. They were certainly no match for him. Old Eagle stands on a tree branch, observing its prey, when it sees an opportunity and the fish flies down to approach the prey. Their main food is fish, in addition to some service birds, lizards and even frogs. Boars have a rough sole that have powerful claws to allow the eagle to hold on to its prey. The crow kept pecking at the baby rabbit in pain, and the mother rabbit, standing next to her, wanted to rush in and save it. But in the end, because of the panic, the mother rabbit had to leave her baby and run away. The baby rabbit looked at the mother helplessly. After trying to resist, the baby rabbit still couldn't get rid of the fierce crow. Seeing that the prey was lying still, the crow pulled the prey into one of its places and enjoyed its work. The snake was surrounded by crows that continuously attacked the snake, taking turns to peck the snake's head. But with consecutive dissections, the snake was not detected in time to avoid it and suffered a painful incision. Seeing that the prey had gradually lost its strength, the crows worked even harder to attack the snake even more fiercely. After the good cooperation of the crows, the prey gradually lost consciousness. It no longer had any resistance, but only received the fierce attack from the crows. The great white pelican was standing with a flock of crows. It swooped down to place the great white pelican. Unfortunately, it immediately grabbed it with its prey. A very easy hunt for the great white pelican. Sea eagles circle the sky looking for their prey and a good opportunity to target by the eagle. 
Not taking action, the Sea Eagle waits for a good opportunity to attack. Waiting for the prey to come to the surface, the Sea Eagle determines the correct position of the target. The Sea Eagle swoops down with its strong legs to grab its prey and fly to the sky. Once the prey is stolen, the Sea Eagle will steal to a safe place and then start enjoying the prey. We hope that you've really enjoyed and found interesting and useful values from the Gecko. We'll continue to bring you exciting stories, information and experiences about the animal world in the future. Thank you for accompanying us.